This demonstration will show how to create and use pre-compiled programming images to program a target with P and E Micros Cyclone Programmer. These standalone programming images, or SAP images for short, are created from the combination of a programming algorithm, object code, dynamic data such as serialization, and scripted programming commands all combined into a single image file. By combining all programming steps into a single programming image, the exact same programming steps will be repeated every single time programming is launched. Once created, all that is needed to start programming is to load the SAP image onto a cyclone. An operator, or automation software, can easily launch programming without the need to understand any of the complexities of the data stored in the image. This demonstration will cover the basic setup of a SAP image including common programming commands and settings used to create a SAP image. Then the SAP image will be deployed directly to a cyclone. Programming will be launched by an operator with a single button press. To begin, launch the cyclone image creation utility. The first step is to choose the type of device that will be programmed. Click Select ARM device and navigate to the desired target. In this example, an ARM-based NXP K64 processor will be selected. In the Configuration and Display Commands box, first select the Choose Algorithm command. It should automatically navigate to the correct folder. Select the programming algorithm for the flash to be programmed. In this case, the algorithm selected will program the device's internal flash. All of the allowed programming commands will appear in the box on the left. Choose QO command and select the object data to be programmed. Multiple files can be chosen. Then we will choose a common set of programming commands for a programming image, erase module, program module, verify module, and secure device. Add a build description for the programming image. This description will be shown on the cyclone when we want to select the SAP image for programming. The second tab, Power and Communication, is where the power and communication settings are selected for the target. If the target is not powered externally, the cyclone is able to provide power to the target. To provide power, jumpers on the cyclone are set. The specific target voltage provided is set up in image creation utility. Check the selection box, Provide Target Power, to open up different options for the target power. The target voltage may be set anywhere from 1.6 to 5 volts. In this case we will select to provide 3.3 volts to the target. Next step we click the Build and Deploy button which will launch the Deployment Manager. The Deployment Manager selects the type of image to be deployed. We have the option to select a standalone programming image or APE Cloud Connected Image. In this example we will deploy a SAP image. The user may also wrap it with encryption or image restrictions. The user may select to generate the image with encryption. Since this SAP image will be loaded directly onto the cyclone, it will be set to No Image Encryption. Deploy options for the image include restrictions to limit by the number of programs allowed or to limit programming to a specified date range. In this example, there will not be any restriction of programming. Select the checkbox to deploy directly to the cyclone. Clicking Deploy will launch the Cyclone Control GUI and connect to the cyclone. Click to apply changes and exit. The image will be pre-selected for programming on the cyclone. A success message in the Deployment Manager shows that it was stored. Before programming launch, verify the target is connected to the cyclone. Click the silver Start button and programming will launch. A success message will appear and the success LED will be illuminated. This demonstration showed the generation of a standalone programming image and deployment directly to a Cyclone FX. Programming was launched on the Cyclone with a successful result. In-depth articles may be found in the PE Micro Learning Center and more extensive SAP image settings may be found in the Cyclone manual. Please visit pemicro.com slash cyclone to see more about our cyclones and their extensive capabilities for production programming.